All right, guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video, and today we are going to go ahead and take a look at the new STR Goku Black. This is going to be the World Tournament reward card for the upcoming World Tournament over on JP. Now, this Goku Black is actually pretty damn good. I'm actually quite intrigued by him. The reason for this, okay, so what is he at? Was that like a 600,000 attack set? That's not bad. That's not bad. So, the reason this Goku Black is going to be very interesting, right? He does a lot. Uh, first off, every time he gets hit, he builds up defense, which is very helpful as a support type unit, which he is. He also lowers attack. Again, that's another thing that's actually very helpful for support type units, and that's the type of thing that will benefit uh, the team greatly because many, many bosses nowadays uh, are susceptible to having their attack lowered. Like, at one time, it, it seemed like Dokkan was kind of moving away from, like, you know, stunning, sealing, attack lowering. But now, you know, there's a few bosses here and there that are uh, immune to attack lowering, but it does seem like Dokkan does want that mechanic to kind of stay relevant, right? Uh, but, you know, something like sealing or stunning, besides, you know, like Super Battle Road, I would say those mechanics aren't really too relevant. You usually, every once in a while, there's a boss, you know, that even in their final phase can be sealed or stunned, but it's certainly not as relevant as attack lowering, right? So that's going to be good for Goku Black. The fact that he's going to be able to do that will be very helpful. Now, the other thing he does is he actually gives buffs uh, to future category allies and time traveler category allies. Now, most un most of the the good units that are, are are in those categories like the future category or the time traveler category a lot of them actually are like pretty much sort of like like they overlap right so like you know a lot of the the trunks cards like all the goku black and zamasu cards they're all both future and time traveler so really this goku black is going to serve as a support type unit of 40% attack and what 20% defense to units like LR Goku Black, uh, SCR Rose Goku Black, TUR Goku Black, and Zamasu. This SCR Goku Black is a, a really damn intriguing option, right? You know, it's always good to have more support type units, more options for these teams, right? If Goku Black had just been a generic hard hitter, you know, maybe he would have been okay, but at, at the end of the day, he would have been kind of forgettable, right? But now, they kind of designed him to be this sort of, like, you know, solid support type unit. So he's going to work very, very well. Now, we're showing him on the Patara team. Uh, that, of course, is... Pretty much, I would say, the best team for the Goku Black units because, uh, you know, 170% attack buff, uh, you know, from both of the LR Super Vegitos. Plus, you know, all of the relevant units are able to be here, right? You know, we could get all the versions of Goku Black. Plus, we can also get the AGL Western Supreme Kai on the team who gives that massive 40% attack buff to Realm of Gods allies. So, you know, we're actually going to be able to have a situation where we're going to have LR Goku Black, you know, get their full attack passive built up. You know, they've got big bad bosses. They share basically the entire same link set with SCR Goku Black. Uh, I believe the one exception is actually Fierce Battle, which is a shame. You know, maybe when like AGL Western Kai eventually awakens, uh, she can get Fierce Battle. Uh, but at the moment, obviously, you know, she, <laughs> you know, she's just an SSR. And then this Goku Black is just an SSR. But the Goku Black, he's just going to awaken uh, into a unit that's going to have Shouting the Limit. Unless they would start letting World Tournament units awaken with uh, medals, you know, like, like uh, medals to get Fierce Battle. I mean, I would be uh very very ecstatic about that i would love to see you know like world tournament units start to get things like fierce battle because that, that would help them out a lot honestly but here's the thing right this goku black is going to add just i i think a, a good amount of attack potency and potential to these units on you know the realm of gods team the patara team i, I would say if you are going to focus on using this scr goku black to probably go ahead and and stick with units that are like of the Goku Black and Samasu family, right? There's so many of them because you have base form Goku Black, 
you have Zamasu, you have Rose Goku Black, you have LR Rose Goku Black and Zamasu, you got Goku Black and Zamasu, and you know, like the list goes on and on. You got Merge Zamasu. There's just so many units uh, that have the capability and potential, uh, like like on these teams. Like you build a full Goku Black team, right? Now the Int Goku Black. We're getting close to uh, LR Goku Black dropping a bombshell, by the way. Uh, like, once we get the full situation set up, LR Goku Black and Zamasu, their uh, attack set is going to be very impressive. Because if you guys remember when we did the video uh, where we got all summonable LR's best attack sets, well, thanks to SCR Goku Black, uh, that has definitely changed for LR Goku Black and Zamasu. Uh, they're now able to get to a much higher level, right? Uh, now, talking about SCR Goku Black versus the Int Goku Black, right? We did just get the Int Goku Black Dokkan Fest very, very recently, right? He is a good unit. Like, I, I would actually even say, like, he's, he's probably a great unit, right? Again, I, you know, I've said many times I do think he's overrated, but that, that doesn't change the fact that he is a ridiculously awesome unit, right? Here's the thing. For the Time Traveler team specifically, you're probably better off going with the Int Goku Black as the leader. You know, you can also run LR Trunks and Mai as a leader for that team, but it, they're not really... You can run them as a leader for the team, but it's only a, a double 130% buff. That's, that's honestly... That's not enough, right? That, that's a, <laughs> a double... Like, you know, we could do a lot better than that. So that's why the Int Goku Black as the leader, I think, is the best option. But of course... You know, there's going to be people who can't pull Int Goku Black. Well, now the SCR Goku Black is going to make a very solid option, a support unit on that team. Uh, especially, like, for Global. If Global does not get the Dragon Ball Heroes cards, then at that point, uh, I would think, you know, uh, SCR Goku Black would take up even more relevance. So, here we go. Here is uh, a pretty good rotation, right? Uh, this will be LR Goku Black and Zamasu with most of their links active. Uh, we also do have the AGL West Kai. So, SCR Goku Black is giving 40% attack. AGL West Kai is also giving 40% attack. Uh, then, of course, you know, uh, LR Goku Black and Zamasu, their full link set outside of Fierce Battle. And it looks like Big Bad Boss is... Oh, nope, never mind. Uh, looks like Big Bad Bosses actually will be activated. Okay, so this is going to be pretty good. So, we'll be able to see what they'll do. Basically, full... This is our best situation for sure. 6.8? <laughs> Whoa! All right. <laughs> so, there we go. Uh, LR Goku Black. And this SCR Goku Black nearly at a million himself. That's very impressive. So, there we go, guys. Uh, LR Goku Black and Zamasu. Like, you know, I I've been very high on them as one of my favorite LRs even to this day. Uh, and I think, you know, that sort of attack number right there really highlights uh, how impressive they still are. Uh, I would say, without question to me, uh, I would say LR Goku Black is the best unit of the original five summonable LRs, right? So, you have LR Gohan, you have LR Majin Vegeta, LR Physical Trunks, you have LR Goku Black and LR Broly. Easily, easily, easily uh, would I say that LR Goku Black and Zamasu is uh, my favorite, and I probably would say they're the best of those five, because, you know, like... LR Broly, LR Majin Vegeta, and LR Gohan, you know, they're, they don't have great defense, right? LR Broly, way worse than the rest, but LR Majin Vegeta and Gohan don't get any sort of defensive buffs. Their defense is still going to be good because they're summonable LRs, but it's not as high as other units can get, right? And then LR Trunks, he does have some defensive potential, uh, provided he supers first, but I, I found that one, occasionally it can be kind of difficult to get LR Trunks' 18 key super. And two, he just doesn't seem to perform quite as good as a lot of the other summonable LRs, right? This is from my experience using... Like, I've had all these summonable LRs rainbowed for a long time. And, you know, I I've just always gotten this indication that Trunks... He he's just not able to put up as much damage as the others. Uh, of course, he could defend a little bit better, but... I think the easy winner is LR Goku Black and Zamasu, uh, you know, because, again, they heal, they are able to hit ridiculously hard, they have an insane link set, and then they are able to raise their defense that same way that LR Trunks does uh, on their super attacks. I'd say the one advantage 
uh, LR Goku Black and Zamasu have is that on their 18 key super, they stack their defense for six turns, whereas I believe LR Trunks only stacks his uh, defense for three turns even on his 18 key super, right? That's sort of the one sort of uh, disadvantage there. So, I, I mean, at this point, I guess we can go ahead and wrap this up. Uh, I actually think this SCR Goku Black is a very good World Tournament reward card. I I may, like, I don't know. I, I feel like he might actually be pretty much the best World Tournament reward card. Like, considering how good he's going to be on teams like Patara, Realm of Gods. You know, future, I mean, he's the best support type unit for the future team now. I don't really consider that a high tier team. But, I mean, you know, it still does have, like, LR Vegito Blue and all those units. Like, that's the thing. Like, this Goku Black is going to be fantastic for units like the Vegito Blue. Like, he's a 40% buff for Vegito Blue type units as well. Like, he's just fantastic. He really might be the best World Tournament reward card. I might sit down and make a list of that top 10 World Tournament reward cards. We'll see. Regardless, thanks for watching, guys. This guy is amazing. I would say grind for him. Definitely make sure you get at least one copy of him. It's not going to be too hard. You only need to get, what, like 23 million points or something like that. So thanks, guys, for watching, uh, and I will catch you all next time.